Hey guys, welcome to day two of answering my followers' questions. Today we are going to graph this function, which is in slope-intercept form, which means the number in front of x is our slope and the constant is our y-intercept. So we want to start with our y-intercept because then we can just go ahead and graph that point wherever it crosses our y-axis, which in this example is negative 1. So I'm going to go to negative 1 and I'm going to make my first point. Then I can use my slope to find my next points, which is our number in front of x, which if there's not a number there, it's really an imaginary one, so negative one over one. And so we're going to rise negative one, so go down one, and we're gonna run to the right one. So we're gonna go down one to the right one, or you could also go up one to the left one. And that's going to create our points to where we can get a ruler, line that up to create our straight line, and there we have it. Comment a math question you'd like to see tomorrow.